welcome back to another video. Today, we continue our playthroughs of Socialist Republic of Italy. Last video, we increased our <coughs> we increased our industry and began making sh and began securing power for our great chairman Benito Mussolini. And now we will finish his reforms to secure power for the chairman. More power for the chairman. Uh, now that we have some political power, Benito Mussolini is going to assign someone new in his military high command. He is going to assign uh, Dorno Funuli, a mechanized defense infantry, ex a mechanized motorized attack person. And a white peace has been signed between our communist brothers in Australia. Our syndicalist brothers in Australia and the Entente after the war for New Zealand. But back to Italy. As the French exiles, as their French Republic exiles now in Africa are facing the threat of rebellious states from Chad. Now Benito Mussolini has secured efforts of improving his industry and radar. Now he is going to focus on his artillery artillery standards as he plans to shoot down the enemies as men are valuable. But bullets are cheap is what he says. And now he plans to finish building any ships that has been put into production. For a while now, and he will finish them, and then we'll start beginning to make convoys for trade around the world. As he does revolutionary commissars to increase his power among Italy. And the fourth Balkan Wars begin between our enemies in Bulgaria and our part and our part allies of Greece, Romania, and Serbia in these nations. But only time will tell what will happen. Only time will tell. He will trap, stop training his units to try to save oil. Um, now, but, now that Revolutionary Commissars has been finished, and him increasing his power, he will up conscription to limited conscription, and after that he shall now start focusing on Spomential to try to increase, to try to decrease training time, recovery rates, and special military forces being more available. And as Benito Mussolini builds his factories, war in the east is expanding. As Bulgaria and those troops are now fighting each other, but Benito Mussolini has now realized that his great allies in China have been defeated. And now tensions are rising in the USA, as a civil war seems to be a brewing as yes, states are rising up for their own ideologies, the paternal autocrat of Douglas MacArthur, who has many options of becoming an American Caesar, or bringing back democracy to the states. The American Union states is an authoritarian Democrat. He is seeking a dictatorship and making every, quote-unquote, every man a king. The Pacific state Pacific states bring are seeking to bring true democracy back to America. 
seek to bring back true democracy and the original government into into trying to return either an American an American dictatorship or an American democracy as ah as in the past. And our uh, great brothers in the compliant cynical states of America with Jack Reed seek to form a cynicless America that will forever live. Now Benito Mussolini has finished Squadrono, and now he will begin his efforts at cementing the chairman's power and remove and s securing that our nation will never be divided once again. And the Second American Civil War has begun. Troops in the southern front against Sicily and the Roman states are now needing to be moved up north to the Italian Republic as slack divisions are causing things to happen. And radical socialism is becoming more popular in a great nation. Which is bad because only Benito Mussolini shall be the true power. As Bulgaria is not occupying Bucharest, our, al our portly allies seem to be losing in this fourth Balkan war. But maybe if the intervention of the Turkish happen, maybe just maybe they can secure vic maybe our ally our part allies secu sec can secure victory. Now, but we shall focus on more thing and more important things such as aircraft. Survivability studies and better bonuses and better equipment and engineering for our said aircraft, as those will be useful in the case of Great War. And the military coup has just happened in Japan, and the Second International Conference has begun! And Hawaii has just broken away from America. In the 1937 workers the Libyad, a glorious day for the working man. And now we can cement the chairman's power. And as we do that, the chairman plans to increase mobilization in our great country. But first, he must solidify the control of his country, as people are against him, which we must stop. And now that the Germans' power has been cemented, we shall now mobilize. The we shall mo then mobilize the industry and expand the un and expand the universities, and then begin on working, assessing the Red Army. And reviewing the guards. Cinema is the most powerful book. Now that Benito Mussolini has the political power, he shall now raise mobilization to early mobilization. And now that he has finished that, he will now begin on better radar. And with better weaponry secured, he will start beginning more heavily on focusing on aircraft production by increasing range improvements to our aircraft. And with more and more factories and ships being finished, Benito Mussolini may just have a chance. And as the Austrian Empire and boils and wars and the and crisis on the Danube. As an ally, as Switzerland goes cynicalist and market liberal, changing to cynicalist ways. The final act of the Second International Conference. And with gun for production finally going into hand, after getting, after that we have gotten better war artillery, and now yet again, we'll be focusing on electronic engineering. 
And now, with the support of guns, we shall send 2,000 weaponry to the to the syndicalist states, hoping that they win this great civil war. But as unlikely as the American Union states seems to be winning heavily in the war, but the syndicalist states may still have a chance. And finally, with weapon production being secured and new divisions being built, new the newest divisions of the Italian army are being trained in the mountains of Florence, of, Tung of Tuscany, for secrecy against enemy radar and spy planes. And now Benito Mussolini, within the next few weeks, shall announce a mil uh, militarized economy secured as Gandhi takes power and our, and our syndicalist and communist allies in the Bharatiyak Bar commune in the fight to unite India. But now, Benito Mussolini announces that within one week we shall militarize the economy fully in a in our stand against the enemies of our great republic, our great socialist republic, and the formation of the Moscow Accord spells doom, as the dumb Dumans and the dumb Duman Senate have secured power, and people of Ukraine have been liberated, but choose a righteous path of social democrats. Still under the thumb of Germany, sadly, but whenever we liberate them, they will be free. But now that we have done that, we will now mobilize, completely mobilize the industry, and Hungary and the Hungarian uprising has sadly failed. But now we will expand industry in all of our great states. As now three civilian factories are being put, to the work on one to increase the great economy and then survival ability studies have been completed and we will now focus more on the aircraft production and strengthening aircraft and Icelandic independence maybe that will spell greatness for their people as they may turn communists to our great cause culture belongs to the master but sadly, they are democratic. But at least they are not market liberal and s s capitalist. But a lot of things are happening around the world as imperialism is decreasing. Belgium has split. But only time can tell what will happen. Now soon we almost have a fully mobilized industry. As soon as we will fully have a fully mobilized industry as we continue working on guns. As yes, after the king abdicated, the people, the farmers and workers of Sweden have united greatly to form the Revolutionary Committee in Sweden and have joined our great cause joining the Third International. But Bulgaria seems to be failing here. Which is good. Maybe revolutions will increase after they lose all of their money after the war. But only time can tell. But our allies and the SNT FA FAI have now started doing it as the Russian Republic tries to unite their great empire under democracy. Yes, we are a democracy as well, but one that is righteous, unlike the unlike those capitalist that rule in Moscow and that and the, our great revolutionaries in Spain are winning but they could always use more now we shall check on our great allies and sending diplomats to the combined some of the states to see how things are doing and yes the great Australian Asian Union has joined the third international and now we have mobilized an issue, we will focus on education. But sadly, the Seneca states do not seem like they will be winning. 
but we shall increase the war support for our great nation as range improvements have been added and focusing on better guns has also been improved is also in better shape as soon after we will start working on the great medium tank and hopefully it shall smash through the mountains with our new motorized that will be built within the next few years and hopefully smash through the Italian mountains and push back Sicily and the monarchist ways but only time can tell when they will start uniting but Hopefully it is not soon, as we have things to do. But, oh, okay, uprising in Venice. This should weaken them so much. Hopefully war will embarrow this land and weaken them, so whenever the time comes, we shall invade them from the north and then go down south. But only time will tell, like I said. And those units are in training that have been secretly chaining the Guardia Rosa. The Visions are halfway through its basic training and it will shall be finished by September 24th. One month from now. A civil war in rules the north. As Venice seeks democracy for the area. But it shall seem that they are not doing good. But the dumb, dirty fascists, led by Italo Bobolo, have already quickly won the civil war in a one a half a month campaign. Although not weakening, not weakening them as much as we as we hoped for, it did at least weaken them just enough. Hopefully for later offensives. With the increase in production, one, two more divisions shall be trained in the mountains of there, and now we will expand our universities as we need more revolutionary minds in our great stand against the cruel enemies of the people. But, soon, we will finish the job, and soon, we may finish off the people who betrayed us. One day, one great day, we shall finally unite Italy under a true righteous banner. But, people must know that only one righteous banner will unite us. Only one. And that will be us. But sadly, the people of the world must realize the great true things that we will put upon them and how good socialism, syndicalism, and communism is. We will show them all what true peace and prosperity and what a utopia must look like. But now that our great divisions have finished training, they will now be put here in the front, and one division each will head to each front line. As our army increases to 18 divisions. And the father of us! The capital of the Carna Spaniards has fallen. And the Paragonian workers, please, with your ally of Chile, defeat those dirty capitalists in Argentina. But we may now look at our great allies of the syndicalist states as sadly they seem to be losing. But now that our great training and completion has been done in the mountains of Italy, we now decide our doctrine. Superior firepower is the only way. This doctrine focuses on throwing shells, not men at the enemy. Our manpower is precious. Bullets are cheap. 
as Mussolini says. All frontline battalions gain ten soft attack, and now we have expanded the universities. And now that we have done that, <coughs> pardon me, we shall now focus on more military things and then start working on the great tank. And now that we have finished that, we will now assess the army. But people of Italy. Time awaits. I will see you in the next video, everyone, for the next video of the series on Monday. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, this video took a very long strain on my voice. This is editor's note here. Uh, I had to add this to the video. I don't know how to edit. I just managed how to combine two recordings together. Uh, me talking... In that way, I didn't try for any accents. I don't think I did anyway. I did terrible, actually. I just thought maybe it'd catch more attention on the video. Uh, I'll see you on Monday, and another video will be out Tuesday, and then I will take a one-day break between those. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I will see you on Monday in the latest video of the Socialist Italy. And maybe, just maybe, we will unite Italy. Please leave a like and subscribe. I know I don't usually do this in the video, but uh, it really helps out and it increases the watch views on my channel. Uh, I want to let you know that, like I said, in the uh, community post, if you want to go look there, uh, Anzio campaign will be out, and right after that, we will have a uh, Operation Overlord campaign for Easy Red 2 out as well. And also around that time, we will have another modded campaign, which this will all be around September, October, and November. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Sorry for making you wait even longer. Have a nice day. Good morning, good night, or see you later, anywhere you are in the world. Goodbye.